Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to a brand new video. So today, as you can see by the title, I will be sharing with you my most complimented dossier perfumes. I was going through my videos trying to figure out what to film for you guys and I realized that I've never actually done like a dedicated video to dossier. I've been working with them for years and years and years and I've never actually done a full dedicated video. So since I didn't know what to film, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna share with my besties what are my top five. I chose five of them because as you can see, I have a whole collection of dossier perfumes, okay? So it was really hard, but I narrowed it down to the most complimented perfumes and then some of them are just like my top favorites. So with that said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up, and you already know, grab your cafecito and let's jump right into today's video. What I'm gonna do is I am gonna pull up the dossier website so I can give you accurate prices as well as the notes even though the perfumes do come with the notes on the packaging i still want to make sure that i don't mess up because you guys know me and my brain we just we don't work together so my returning viewers you guys you know who they are i've talked about them for years and years but if you stumbled upon this video and you so happen to click on this video because you're just curious and you don't know who Dossier is, I just quickly wanted to introduce them. They are an affordable brand to luxury perfumes. They are clean and vegan, cruelty-free, and the packaging is really cute, really. It is so minimalistic, it's cute, it's simple, it's to the point, and they do use a glass bottle. So they do recycle a lot of their products, which I thought was very neat. If you have the same taste and perfumes as I do, then yes, you're going to like them. I'm definitely more of a floral, fresh, or fruity type of girl. I don't really like the musky, woody scents that are really strong. They just don't work good with my body chemistry. So with that said, let's jump right in because I don't want to ramble on too much. Okay, so first perfume that is up is actually one of Dossier's best sellers. This one right here is Ambry Saffron. I could be pronouncing that wrong and I'm sorry if I am. Regular price for this is $49, which is still amazingly cheap compared to the real deal so this one is inspired by mfk's baccarat 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 rouge 540 the retail price for that perfume alone is 300 dollars. now i know some people like to spend that much there's nothing wrong with that um but compared to 49 dollars, yes so this one right here has top notes of saffron orange blossom the middle notes are jasmine plum and cedarwood and the base notes are oak moss fur balsam and amber i love a little bit of amber in there because it gives you a little bit of that warmth to your scent it creates a little bit of richness it's literally the perfect scent to feel very feminine it lasts all day it smells super super delicious i love especially spraying this on my clothes because it just really lingers nine out of ten times i will be complimented when i'm wearing this i will get asked what i'm wearing so ambery saffron is definitely one to buy you guys again a blind buy that i think is totally worth it if you kind of like the Ariana Grande Cloud, it's similar to that. They don't smell the same. I think the Ariana Grande smells a lot sweeter than this. This is more toned down, but they have a lot of the same like base notes that makes them smell somewhat same. So yeah, that's my first pick, which is Emery Saffron. Second one is, let's see, let's pick... Um, let's pick one that I guess I am almost out of. This is my second bottle, I believe. So this is the old packaging and I believe this is the new packaging. So let me pull her up. So this is called Citrus Green Apple and this one is inspired by Dolce & Gabbana's Light Blue. The retail, retail price for the Dolce & Gabbana is $82 and the price for the dossier is only $29. So super affordable. By the way, you are getting 1.7 fluid ounces. This is a lot of perfume, okay? The top notes are green apple, lime, and citrate. 
The middle notes are bluebell, jasmine, and rose. That's like my absolute favorite. And the base notes are amber, cedarwood, and musk. So as you can see, I have a thing for like the warmer scents. It is so light with hints of florals and like citrus. Again, perfect for the summer if you're looking for that go-to summer scent. Citrus green apple is definitely going to be your girl. Trust me. Next up is one that kind of took me by surprise because I remember trying this a few years ago and not really loving it. And then I recently picked it up and I was like, oh my gosh, I love this perfume. So this is Musky Musk. And please excuse my ugly handwriting. I wrote the perfumes inspiration, which now I kind of hate it. <laughs> but this is, again, Musky Musk. And it is inspired by... Juliet has a guns, not a perfume. The retail price for that is $100 and the price for this one is $29. The reason why I fell in love with this scent is because I actually got an original scent from Julian, Juliet has a guns, not a perfume little sample from Sephora and I fell in love with the scent. I was like, wait a second, I think I have the dupe for it. And sure enough, I went through my collection and I found this little gem right here. This is a very like fresh out of the shower type of scent. I will have to say that I feel like this is a little bit stronger than the original one, um, but it lasts so much longer than that. And this is also one of those perfumes that you can actually layer. I personally love layering scents. You kind of have to just like try and see what works with what. But another great thing to do is to kind of look at the notes and compare to see what other perfume you have. So if the notes are similar, you can definitely like mix them together and make your own concoction of perfumes. And then you smell like your own self, if that makes sense. Now this perfume, it took me a while to kind of like come around it because these are scents that I don't always love on me. But once I actually wore it all night, I became obsessed with it. So this is Ambery Vanilla. And this one is inspired by YSL's Black Opium. That is like an OG to YSL. If you have smelled any other like Black Opium kind of like a collection they have, I think two or three. This one is probably my favorite one. The retail price for that one is $104 and the price for this one is $29. That is $75 less expensive than YSL. Now this one, the top notes are Mandarin, Pear, Pink Pepper. Pink Pepper actually smells so rich and so like spicy. Um, licorice, which I did not know I liked in my sense, but I have quickly fallen in love with it. The middle notes are jasmine. Jasmine is one of my favorites and orange blossom. Orange blossom also gives it that like citrusy scent. And then the base notes are cedarwood, patchouli, vanilla, and coffee. Hello, like we talk about coffee all the time. This one is described to smell as an iced vanilla latte and I am here for it. Like I love lattes. I love coffee. I love vanilla scents and this hits the right spots. This is a scent that I personally like to wear at night or in the evening. It's one of those scents, you know, you have your like daytime perfumes and then you have your nighttime perfumes. This is it. This is your nighttime perfume, literally. This is also a great layering scent if you have any perfumes that have like coffee or caramel or vanilla in them. It's just going to smell so delicious. It's sweet. It's not too sweet though. It's just like the perfect amount. It's giving girls night out. It's giving I'm single and ready to mingle. Not me, I'm married, I'm happily married. But if you're single and ready to mingle, this is the perfume you should probably pick up. <laughs> My very last pick, and I probably should have mentioned this one towards the beginning because this is probably, I would say it's maybe like my first choice for Dossier perfumes. And I'm gonna show you how much I love this perfume. So this is my old bottle. I mean, it's not like all the way down, but it's very well loved. And this is a brand new bottle. I just got this one because Again, my mom fell in love with it and I was like, okay, I'm gonna get you one and then I'm just gonna keep one to myself. So I have two here, again, Floral Violet. This one is inspired by Marc Jacobs Daisy. Oh my gosh, this is such an OG scent, you guys. If there is one perfume that I can absolutely, with all the confidence 
in my body say you're going to love it's floral violets this smells so delicious this one is only 29 dollars 57 dollars less expensive than marc jacobs you're welcome it's very soft very romantic very dewy just like a very pretty clean aesthetic girl if you're a very minimalist girl this is it and the top notes for this is watermelon i never thought watermelon would be such a beautiful scent pomelo and strawberry so this is definitely leaning a little bit more sweet slash fruity uh, the middle notes are violet gardenia and jasmine so it's going to have some hints of floral because of those middle notes and then the base notes are musk vanilla and blonde woods so that's what gives it that like um like that a little bit of warmth but with a little bit of floral if that makes sense i hope i describe these scents well because i know that i'm really bad at describing scents um let's see what else did i want to share i think that is it you guys like this is probably my most loved scents like i will continue to purchase it over and over again because it is that that good and it is so spot on to mark jacobs it's absolutely insane how identical they smell to each other so so that is it you guys these are my top five favorite slash most complimented dossier perfumes thank you so much for watching and a huge shout out to dossier for continuing to support my channel by sponsoring my videos literally it means the world to me that you guys are working with me let me know in the comment section down below your thoughts and what your favorite scent is don't forget to use my link and my discount code to save even more money on these affordable products if you guys are going to pick up one scent let me know which one it is because honestly you need them all but i understand just just one for now will do so that is it for me you guys thank you so much for being here i love you all stay safe and until next time i'll see you guys in my next video bye